Hey, in this video, I'll be discussing the 10,000 mile update MPG for my 2021 Jeep Gladiator Mojave and seeing if it's getting any better than the 15.5 uh, MPG it was getting at 1,000 miles. Let's go ahead and get started. Hey everyone, this is Robert from Sherburn Outdoors. Hey, uh, today we're gonna be doing a, a, an MPG update. I got a couple emails sent to me asking me how's it going. So I'm just getting ready to cross uh, 10,000 miles. I'm at 900, or sorry, 9,997 miles. We'll flip it around in a minute and take a peek. Um, a couple uh, disclaimers before we get started. I have added some upgrades, which uh, did increase the weight. Uh, we added this billy bar system. You can see right here, both the crossbars and the molly panels. And we did put an inch and a half lip from Terraflex, just the, the, the bump stops kind of lift things up a little bit. And then we did move to 35 inch tires, but I did stay on the same rims. Uh, so that has been a little bit of a weight increase, but I'll be honest, we haven't really noticed any sluggishness on the car or anything. But let's go ahead and get started. So in January, no, maybe it's February, because uh, it was still cold outside. Uh, I did a 900 and I think it's 40 mile review. And roughly we're at 15.5. You know, we weren't at the average of 19 uh, or the 17 city and 22 highway, which I have never gotten. Uh, we we're at 15 and a half. So today, let's take a look at where we're at. I did keep the odometer the same uh, for taking, a, uh, not the odometer, but the trip uh, from the factory. So I've never actually changed it for trip A, but I did change it for trip B so we can see what the next 9,000 miles look like. Let's flip it around. All right, if we take a peek in here and get a little, get pretty close, you can see actually I'm, I'm averaging 16.8, which is significantly higher uh, than it was. Now I've done some trips recently um, where I had reset, I always reset it after each gallon, uh, each uh, fill up to see where we're at. But um, you know, that's not too bad. So if we kind of look around at where we've been, I think I drove to the airport and stuff. So I was actually getting around 17. But um, if we come down to our trip info, and this particular trip is 9,997.5 miles. I don't know about the 72 hour stuff, but I'm averaging 15.8 across the entire ownership of the Jeep. Now, when we did this before, I actually flipped this around and, uh, and start restarted trip B. Uh, so trip B is about 9,000 and you know what? It's a, it's a little shittier than uh, trip A. So we're at 15.7 uh, MPGs for the last 9,000 miles after I did the last video on trip B. So uh, really not that great. And you know what? I'm getting ready to add a, a steel Rubicon bumper to the front of this and a winch this week. So I'm guessing I'm going to go down probably from there. But hey, you don't buy a Jeep Gladiator for the... Uh, for the fuel economy. If you're wanting that, go buy a Tesla or a Leaf or something like that. Uh, they, I mean, these things are basically cinder blocks rolling around. They aren't aerodynamic at all. But hey, I love this thing. I'm giddy whenever I get in it. Uh, cannot wait to get in it all the time. Um, have it, I, I'm just so happy with this thing. It is just, I just ecstatic at it whenever I get in. I'm just giddy driving it. I've um, been enjoying the camping aspects of it with the rooftop tent. Um, it works really well on here. It looks really well. It's also, my existing equipment works pretty good with it. Had to make some modifications. But getting back to the, uh, the uh, fuel modifications, I wouldn't change anything. I'm guessing I'm going to go down to probably 15.5, and that's where I'm probably going to be for the life of this thing. I'm not doing anything differently. I think the engine has broke in a little bit, and so it is getting a little bit more better fuel economy, but I've also added the weight. So anyway, that's a 10,000 mile update. Maybe at 20,000, I'll come back and we'll do another one, see how things go. Hey, if you like this kind of content, go ahead and click that like button. Don't forget to hit subscribe and click that bell to be notified when new videos are available. Hey, thanks everybody. 